Political debates are an important part of the democratic process in the United States. They help the public decide which candidates to vote for and can sometimes prove controversial. But did you know that a series of debates between Abraham Lincoln and Illinois Senator Stephen A. Douglas proved so divisive they helped bring the nation to war? Taking place at a time of major political upheaval in the U.S., when the issue of slavery and questions of racial equality were central to both local and national politics, the Lincoln-Douglas debates, as they came to be known, were part of the 1858 Illinois Senate race between incumbent Stephen A. Douglas, member of the Democratic Party, which was split over the issue of slavery between North and South, and challenger Abraham Lincoln, who belonged to the newly formed Republican Party, which was anti-slavery and rooted firmly in the North. Held in seven of the state's nine congressional districts between August and October, the debates were widely publicized and were attended by an estimated 72,000 people. For the majority of the debates, each candidate was given one and a half hours to speak. Lincoln took the opportunity to lay out his vision for the future, arguing that slavery was wrong and that it should not be allowed to expand into the territories. But Douglas believed forcing abolition on the states would be undemocratic and could potentially lead to war. The contest focused the nation's attention on the deepening divide between North and South over the moral and political implications of slavery and proved that a compromise would be hard to find. Although Lincoln lost to Douglas in the race for the Senate, the debates raised his profile on the national stage and set him up for a run at the White House. In 1860, he became the first Republican to be elected president, with all of his electoral votes coming from northern states. As a consequence, between December 1860 and May 1861, 11 southern states voted to secede from the Union, and the country went to war. How do public debates facilitate, influence, and shape public opinion? <laughs> 